Phillips and I'm director of the awarding organisation EDI. Now, as we know, colleges are facing some difficult times in, in terms of funding and working with employers is something that's always been on um, the, the priority list for, for their education colleges. Now, we know that the government spend about four billion on uh, publicly funded qualifications uh, in the vocational areas. Um, but one of the very interesting facts that's, um, that's up there and out there, and it's the CBI Skills Survey report, that employers in England alone spend £38 billion of their own money on training. Now, that presents a huge opportunity for the FE college sector, and um, it's something that we've been able to provide um, practical advice and guidance and the real ability to work engagingly with employers. We work with about 50 household names, including the likes of Virgin Media, Sainsbury's and Clinton Cards for just a few examples. Now, what we've been able to do, we have a model for um, working with employers. We can offer them one of three options and frequently colleges don't always know what options are available for working with employers. The first option is that we can take uh, in-company programmes and endorse the qualifications. So we really provide a quality assurance service around those um, in-company programmes. The second thing is that we can work with um, employers to get some of their individual units onto the QCF. It's one of the great advantages of the, the QCF. Or if employers really want, they can take their in-company programmes and map them to full nationally recognised qualifications. In that way, they're actually available for funding should they require that. Um, but it's the very practical advice and the very practical um, guidance that we can give um, to the FE college sector to help them engage um, and improve the engagement process with employers. Um, we're able to provide them with, uh, with, with toolkits. Frequently, uh, employers don't always know what they want. Um, and one of the things that we do, we, we work with them through a seven-step strategy process. Now, we can provide that to colleges as part of their toolkit. We, we have materials that we can joint brand with the FE sector. Uh, we don't have any problems with that at all. Um, but really, it's about um, getting a result out of it. As I said at the beginning, four billion from public funding, 38 billion in England alone for companies on their own training pro um, programs. And that's moving up the agenda as the public funding comes under further pressure.